that is very interesting story were inspired by many of us because uh, the one ship of uh, 16th century called the uh, Reef Day, the friendship, uh, settled uh, in accident in small island in, in Oita prefecture. And then most of all of the sailors were saved by the local people of Oita. And this is the real starting point of Japan and Dutch relationship. Then the governor and us uh, really want to recreate this legendary tradition how the most top leading, talented and mindful and the gorgeous artist or designer can visualize to the Oita and Japanese people. This kind of uh, so-called uh, prince of Dutch design has this kind of really deep emotional uh, passion on his design. I immediately decided to ask Marcel to uh, revisualize this trend of uh, uh, legend of uh, meeting of uh, first meeting of Dutch and Japan, and then I I thought that I hit in my mind that uh, this must be called as a Eurasian garden, Euro-Asian garden. Then I asked Mao to make a huge installation utilizing our super high ceiling giant uh, atrium hall space. I was really deeply amazed to this deep concept with the combination of new technology. It's really uh, the gift for the Japanese children as a huge balloon moving slowly and very, it, it's, uh, it's really natural sensuality. And then also uh, it's a really prayerful object and with the deep concept. He told me that this is an endless image of death. Then I realized endless death means endless life. And then meeting life and death get together in such a gorgeous contemporary technological way. That is very fantastic for us. <laughs> 